come on and do more harm than good. But I think as the years have gone by, coaches have got so much better at their on-court coaching. It's a tricky situation. It is. It is because you're, you're dealing with the, the match emotions. And that's another intangible you have to throw in there. And yeah, we have seen in the past as well, as we look at this pass from Radvansky once again, that sometimes maybe coaches throw out a lot of ideas, maybe too many ideas. Well, yes. Um, I've been in the situation myself that I've been doing the on-court coaching at a WTA Did event. You know? And it is one of those things that you kind of learn as you go on. I've made mistakes with it. I've said too much. Sometimes I've said too little. And I think one of the things is is that as a coach, you're, you're willing to learn and to become better, but also you have to really understand your player. You have to know exactly 30, what they want to hear and when they want to hear it, most importantly, when. Yeah, different personalities, right? So you have to adjust to that personality. It's, um, you know, you're mic'd up and the world is hearing what you have to say. And if you're working with a, with a player who's got quite a volatile you know demeanor on the court and can really give something back to you well there's an art to dealing with that a super point totally in control from the from the with the use of the kick serve she was able to hold on to the baseline and she just kept radvanska moving didn't go for too much just a beautiful put away volley So Bartol holds after that easy Radvanska hold. We move along in this third set, 15. Yeah, I, I must. She's querying the score, and I'm. And then 15 30. She missed that point. Good job. It was just here. Good job. Ask the supervisor. Yeah, it so. Was, it was. I want two points. That's first and third. <laughs> What was the score? I'm honestly happy. What was the score? No! She missed the forehand like one meter out. Can you ask anyone there, whoever was paying attention? Yeah, there seems to be confusion with the score. And in hindsight, yeah. It was 40-15 on the last it's, point. I thought she'd seriously? won two points at least for Radvanska because Bartol missed a forehand. <coughs> no, she, she didn't win three points in a row. And she I don't know if you remember, but at the Australian Open this year, there was an incident similar to this with Radvanska that the, the umpire got it all wrong and she brought the supervisor, the supervisor out. Come on court and, do and the supervisor changed the opinion of the umpire. It's very unusual for her, obviously, to to argue with an umpire, which is usually spot on. I think you're alright. Let's see, can't be 100% sure. Yeah, I I remember, tell me. It's right? He says it's right? So it's, so it's.
30-40. After that. 40-30. 40-30. And now it's Deuce. 40-30. 